for you. All of you that are exalted in the name of Jesus. Father, Lord, we thank you for the great opportunity you have given unto us to gather in your presence once again. We thank you, we appreciate you, for it is not by our power, not by our might, not by our wisdom, but by your grace and mercy. You have counted us worthy to be among the living souls that will worship you this morning. Father, accept our thanks in the name of Jesus. Lord God Almighty, we are going into your world. You are the world. For it is written that the entrance of your word gives light and it gives understanding to the simple. Father, Lord God Almighty, as we are going into your world this morning, Lord God Almighty, let there be light. Father, let there be light. Amen. Lord, let there be light. Amen. I the vessel that you shall be using as a shadow to your world this morning, I humble myself before you. I want this your children to see and to hear from you alone. Father, do so in the name of Jesus. Amen. If there is any anti spirit, every spirit of confusion, every spirit of distraction, every spirit of weariness, every evil spirit that do not permit this world to have meaningful impact in your children's lives, wherever such spirit is hiding right now, Lord, banish and cast it into the lake of fire. Amen. Holy Spirit of God, take charge. Amen. Holy Spirit of God, take charge. Amen. Holy Spirit of God, take charge. Amen. Father, at the end of this one, let all glory, all honor, and adoration be yours alone. Amen. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, For Lord. in Jesus' mighty name we are prayed. Amen. 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 In Jesus' name. Before you sit down, as a living soul, that the Lord has counted worthy. To be alive today and to also be in his presence that you know it is not by our power not by our might not by our wisdom not by our righteousness but by his grace I want you to shout something powerful Hallelujah 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 They clap in offering to the Lord Clap for Jesus we welcome everybody to this gathering of salvation in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. I pray as you have come today, the Lord shall meet you as you come in the name of Jesus Christ. You can't answer me. Amen. I said as you have come today, the Lord shall meet you at your point of needs in the name of Jesus Christ. You will not go back empty-handed. We thank God for his mercy, for his kindness, for his grace, for his protection, for counting us worthy to be, to be among the living souls. Some that were better off, some that were more knowledgeable, some that were stronger, have passed away. It is not by our power, not by your wisdom, not by your righteousness, not that to deserve to be alive. But by His grace and mercy, He has granted you worthy to be among the living souls. You did not stumble, you did not fall, people did not call you. All the plans of the enemies against you, God frustrated you. Where the enemies thought that they would capture you, the Lord made you escape. At the point where they thought that they have even they have overpowered you. They saw the hand of God. And they were rendered powerless. And through it you are alive today. You are head and heart. No evil has befallen you. You that appreciate God. Shout Hallelujah. I pray in the name of Jesus Christ. This year you will not swallow me. Amen. I am saying it authoritatively. This year, 2022, 2022, will not swallow you. Amen. There is somebody here. The Lord said, I should proclaim it to you. The point where people are meeting you every year, every month, that they have seen that that is the way, that is where you are. And they have concluded that you cannot leave the place. I decree and declare, in this year, the Lord will move from that point, the mighty hand of God shall move you to a greater height. Amen. That is for thanks. The topic the Holy Spirit has brought for today's sermon is the continuation that is the part two of last week's topic. And who can remind me? Eh? Uh,
Somebody is saying something. Else. And you can't song come, me, baby. Uh huh. Yes. Opportunity for supernatural expansion. And we have gotten to a stage last week. I will proceed from that stage that we stopped last week. And in that topic, we are able to know supernatural expansion, the explanation, the meaning, the interpretation, and likewise opportunities. And the component of opportunities we are to know that we have three major components of opportunities which are time, chance, circumstance. They are the three major components of opportunities. There is no up, there is nowhere opportunity will be available without the availability of these three components. Whatever opportunity you might talk of, you will find time in it. You will find, find chance and you will find circumstance. And we were made to know what time Chance and, and, uh, uh, circumstance. So in that time, we all know what time means. Also, in the process, in the when we talk of chance, that is the probability of something happening. The probability of happening is what you mean by chance. And when it's when in all in all situations there is always chance but in where, where, where chance is having uh, the part which chance is having the upper hand that is where you now see the manifestation hallelujah Amen. time to get chance time Time begets chance. Chance begets circumstance. We can liken it to Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. It was the Father that made the Son to be known. And it was through the Son that the Holy Spirit is made known. Likewise, time, chance, and circumstance. If one is not supporting the two others, there will not be manifestation. Oh, I said the manifestation will be be otherwise. Be so the three of them work together to bring results. And when in that book of Ecclesiastes chapter, chapter 9 verse you know, 9, when, when, was was talk, when it was talking there, he said that uh, the race I have seen something under the earth. The rest is not for the, the sweet. And, and likewise, he mentioned up to the now said, but time and chance happen to them all. See, when, uh, or, when uh, failure is having greater chance of success, that is when you will see failure Manifesting. That is where the probability of failure is higher than the probability of success. When you will see failure in action. So the three of them, they work and in hand. And when they work against somebody, the person will be experiencing sin. It will be working. It is not that they will, not, they will work. Chance, chance, chance and circumstances. They will work. They are always at work. But what happens is that either they work negatively or positively. When they work negatively against somebody, then such a person will be seen negative results. Nothing will happen of joy in the life of the person. But when they work positively no matter how, uh, how should I put it? How foolish the person will be. People will be seeing results. Because time, chance, and circumstances are operating. I agree into a life. In this 
yeah. those three components of opportunity will work positively in your life. I am talking to somebody in this year 2022. Time, chance, and circumstance will bring positive results into your life. And your testimony will be established. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Now, I want us to understand that opportunities can be missed. And missed opportunities can mean missing your divine destiny. You know, I didn't say will. That is, at times, it might not be that. But when opportunity is missing, it can mean it, when opportunity is missed it can mean missing of your divine destiny hallelujah Amen. I decree and declare in this year you will not miss your opportunity somebody is not answering I said in this year 2022 you will not miss your opportunity Amen. Now, we are going to the reasons why opportunities can be missed. The reasons why opportunities can be missed. Number one, Akoko. lack of self-esteem. I need go ya. I, I, should I say, that? okay, let me put it in a simple way. Lack of self-respect. I need, lack, I powerful, I powerful, I need, I Lack of self-esteem can cause missing of opportunities. What do I mean by that? When you don't respect yourself, when you don't value yourself, at the end of the day, it can make you miss opportunities. Hallelujah. Amen. In the book of Genesis, Genesis. chapter 25, when we check from verse 31 there to 32 when you the Esau and Jacob they were together Esau was the one having the best rights but because he lost his self esteem because he did not he lacked respect for himself he threw away that opportunity he missed it away he missed it by his, uh, what is, uh, what is the value of this uh, best right that we are uh, uh, just carrying about oh, give me that muscle of life let me eat it and whatever it is take it is it not better to take it and he lost it some people when see when you don't have when you don't value yourself there is no how people will value you and when you don't value yourself you will eat what not to eat you will drink what not to drink you will associate with those who are not you to associate with and at the end of the day it frustrates the life of the person it makes someone to miss opportunities I remember when there was a particular story that I, I, heard, I, I heard I came across somebody and we, we can in one way or the other we have no, no, all experience experienced as such as come as across such stories we are we are by a lady Arabiri. was dating uh, a, a man just because of money and they were going out the man was spending for her and she had already known that man was a married man and man had made her know that I'm just using you to pass by and she was uh, is it not to collect money and she was doing it by the time now came for her to settle down she traveled to another place and came across a man and they started Dating. on a certain day they decided to introduce themselves to their parents so that from there they perfect their marriage in the process of taking the man and the ma uh, the woman to his parents the father realized that it was the lady that they were sleeping together what will happen 
you have already known that this thing is not a, a is it not to just a, is it not to just enjoy myself is it not to it has made some people to miss their opportunities. It, it can be from man to I'm saying of woman to man. Now. It it can be be from from my man to woman. Oh, let's get talking. 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 let us get you are going out to somebody. If you, you, are, are, if you have stayed from such person that maybe you are so just dating, and maybe and you are you agree together like you are, you want to go into a relationship, but there is nothing in between you. At any point in time, maybe you now discover that the man was no longer serious or the woman was no longer serious. You will train yourself that you can come across somebody closer to the person. At, at the long run, which might now have interest and be serious so, and, to and settle down with them. Them. But, but with just to me to uh, this thing, uh, opportunity has to be Hallelujah. Amen. Number two, like lack of action. I need they say lack of action. I need they say can result to oh, missing opportunities. When you instead where you supposed to take action, where you supposed to act, when you refuse to act there, it might break, it might make you to, to be disappointed. Oh, the your opportunity. When God told uh, uh, told Moses, in the book of uh, Exodus chapter eight. He, he told Moses, go and tell, let my people go. Go serve me. Go and tell Pharaoh. Moses will decide that he will not go. Moses will decide that he will not go. And he would have missed the opportunities of expressing signs and wonders. What God can do. He would have missed it. At the Lord when he took the step. At, at, at the end, he brought them out. At the end, he brought them out. He brought them out. Of Egypt. And as they were going, they were heading to the Red Sea. When they went to that point of the Red Sea, they saw the enemies coming behind. Till they got to the side of the Red Sea, the Red Sea did not pass. It was remaining there. And when they got there, he was now. He told the Israelites, "Come down. Let us see what God will do." His expectation was that God would. He will not see that the rest he will not see that the it is tough. He said, stretch it to the he could think that uh, uh, what is, how do they relate? I should put uh, uh, the no, 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 he saw the rest of the party and immediately the, it is not only party but he now saw because when even if, it, if the water should dry up the depth of the land in the sea would have seen some of them but what God just demanded was this action take action upon this and after taking the action the rest was left for God to answer and God answered it and everything was perfect when you refuse to take action and you are expecting miracle of opportunity from God it cannot work you have to take action there is something that has been in your mind that you but we shall see that you are expecting mana from him until you take action upon it, it. that is when God will now support it that is when opportunity will come into your life the word of God the action that will bring results of joy to your life as you are descending from this mountain we are going to begin to take it Amen. number three greed 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 can make one miss. Oh, you can't call all the day. You can't call so I'm Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Are you angry? Hallelujah. Amen. Greed. 
you can make one mission. When this thing at times, when you find yourself not composed, at some point, some things that you're supposed to give out, or to make others to benefit, you might try to take it to yourself. And at the end of the day, it brings destruction. It will deprive you of greater things. You and, uh, uh, you and uh, somebody who is a business together. Uh, 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 Once the money now comes, you so now begin to, to look as like a, like a, a thief on the roof. That I, eh, I will now, now, I will now, 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 just need to think. Sorry, don't, I need to help you. Work at the local power plant. This one, I don't know. We are not going to be able. You didn't lie. You said only one is lecture. You only one is lecture. Come. It has met many people. Oh, did you hear the opportunities? Come, 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 come. I am praying, praying, praying. One thing, Badura. One Badura. No answer. One race. Great. Oh, you come, come. I I watched a a short uh, playlet. Mo wo ereke kereko. Whereby a man was, uh, he was going with his girlfriend. Oh, and he come by or every year. And he pretended to be poor. Oh, wow. oh, 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 she be any poor. Oh, no, no, no. He now left the lady inside the car. Oh, what's your rabbit? He went to, to buy uh, some things. Oh, Lord, I want cocoa. Before he came back, the man had approached her. I was talking about her. her. He, he, saw brought, he brought a very fine car. Oh, Mumma, oh, Bemo, to Lawa. And the man now started trying to convince her <inaudible> of <inaudible> <what> <inaudible> <realized> <inaudible> <she> <inaudible> falling. <inaudible> she had fallen for him and she left. The man was now calling her that her. So she said, oh, I don't <inaudible> <have time inaudible> she, 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 she left the car and went to the car. That car, the man that came to call her was his driver. He now drove to drive. The man went to meet him that time. <inaudible> Look at how sheep you are. Great. Great. So, so many people, this, the what they are passing through now, they support they support to them to them to let oh, yeah, but great made them to still remain there. Uh, around 2011 or thereabout, there was, there was a, a, somebody very close to us. He, close. He, he was having a transaction with another person. So the transaction has to do with a good oil and so, the profit they will be making there. Oh, the, oh, 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 they will oh, 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 and they wanted to do the transaction. Oh, best, that they will be sharing two, two billion. And he will be taking four billion. He now, because he was the one that brought that, he now said that to add uh, some amount of money to it. Oh, well, look, the man who was cool. trying to add, oh, what when, they, cool. when they calculated it, so. it will result to like, like uh, 50 billion. He was not saying, you own, if they don't agree for but him to... I add that uh, that will not permit the, the transaction to succeed. At the long run, the transaction failed. He became somebody that was living in a single room. He left Abuja for a lorry. Because of greed. I pray you will not miss it in this year. Amen. Number, number four. 
Ikeri. Career minded. Career minded. When you are career minded, it can make someone to miss opportunity. Hallelujah. Amen. See, opportunity can come from anywhere. When you are focusing only on your career, that is only on this individual career as you opportunity comes from another, from another point, from another source, to another source, you might not be able to take notice. So many people that succeeded. Not their profession. It's not they their profession. They their profession. Not their success. Not their success. Not their success. Not God knows that if you succeed at times, he knows that when you succeed, he will be faithful you are. He will not give the glory to him. If you take it at her, it is by my strength. It is by my knowledge. And when God perceives that, he uses another form to bring results. But when you are focusing on your career, it is in this line of success. It is in this line of success. When your Opportunity comes. You can buy yourself even and it's over to another person. The person has now taken it. And then you now say, Now let this thing go to me before. I know you know how foolish I can do it. Don't be career minded. I'm not saying that you should not focus on your career. But as you are focusing on it, also be having it in mind that opportunity can come and see it. It can come from any, any point. It can come from any source. And when it comes, you get results. When you are able to grab it, in that book of Matthew chapter 19, verse 2, Matthew. Jesus Christ was telling the rich man, he was a very rich man, but was anxious of making heaven. And he went to Jesus. He told him, he had been giving arms to beggars. He had given He had he had kept all the Ten Commandments. He had kept all the from his side And he was thinking that that is what will take him to heaven. And when he came across Jesus, he was asking Jesus, what can I do to make, the, uh, to make heaven? Jesus Christ told him, Jesus of Uwipe, you have to do this. He said, you can write for my child. Jesus Christ, he said, hey, okay. Go and send everything you have and get a better opportunity. The scripture said, he felt so bad because he was having much At the end of the day, he missed it. Not only everyone alone. At times, if you are you are focusing at this thing. It can make someone to derail. I pray you will not fail. Now, number five. Procrastination. Procrastination. Somebody check the book of James chapter 4, verse 13 to 14. James 4, 13 to 14. James 4, 13 to 14. Yes. Uh huh. Uh huh. Today or tomorrow. That is, you are not specific. Either today or tomorrow. Yes. We will go to this or that or that city. Uh huh. Yes. Uh huh. Why? When you don't even know what will happen tomorrow. Procrastination. Procrastination. It has been like this thing. You have, you have, you have known that you're supposed to do it. You are having it in mind that you want to do it. Then you are now shifting it. Uh, okay, today, 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 tomorrow. When tomorrow comes, today, say, uh, uh, it is tomorrow. Uh, there is one uh, in our uh, uh, tribe. We said, or light. Or light tomorrow or, doesn't finish. Or or like it, or, that is tomorrow doesn't get finished. When it is tomorrow, it will be tomorrow. When it is tomorrow, it is tomorrow. You are shifting it, shifting it, shifting it, shifting it. And, shifting it, and, it, and, and, it, and, and at the end of the day, okay. you refuse to cook or make. And you are expecting one results. 
you have to conclude to either see some people what brings such is at times it is fear what if I fail? See, if you fail, there is still room for you to take. See, it is better to fail than not try at all. Why you fail you will not be able to fail and you will be able to restart the case yourself. But you don't know where you have failed. How can you have failed? Without taking any time, you don't know whether you pass or not. There is no student can, that can be promoted without exa examination. No matter how, even if it, if it is the father, we are uh, when we are in our secondary school, uh, our, some of our like two or three of them, they were that their father was the proprietor of that school, but they had to sit for examination. So no matter how God loves you, you might do to like to take that step, make that decision first. If you fail, it will now embrace you. He said, When my father and my mother forsake me, the Lord will take me. So, why, if you now decide to, to like, not like trying to recognize your father, how would they now know whether they forsake you or not? Take that step first. Don't stop procrastinating. Take that step. Make that decision. Then we see him manifesting. Hallelujah. Amen. Lastly, wrong mindset. Wrong mindset. When you are having. When you are having a wrong mindset, when you are having a wrong mindset, it can make someone to miss opportunity. I can remember some period back when we were, we were very young. We were trying to play ball. And uh, that, every time we call us, said, look at this city. Look at this uh, village. Look at this city. Look at this uh, uh, local government. Look at this uh, state. Who have you seen that uh, played ball to succeed? If nobody has succeeded, it doesn't mean that it, it is somebody that first start, that started to succeed. David said, I was in the wilderness. Lion came. Lion came. I destroyed them. So, this person, all circumcised, he said, my faith, I was not going to go to my father. 
Change your mindset. Uh, 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 whenever I see this thing, this sign, I know it's a failure. Uh, 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 and this is and the scripture says, uh, all uh, things uh, work for, together for good uh, for uh, those uh, that work uh, and uh, uh, with God. Uh, all all uh, things are uh, also for the shishé. So what is that sign you are saying? That that are trying to scare you. you to have that strong mindset that, 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 that they cannot walk. walk. Who tells you that? that? See, hear the word of God. If they are not marrying in your generation. See what about him? As from today, you will marry. See what about him? If they are not marrying in your generation. See what about him? How do I declare this year? You will make it. If people are rising and falling in your generation, I declare. I decree and declare if people are expressing barrenness in your generation, I decree and declare from today, no more barrenness in your life. If people are suffering from one disease or the other, from one sickness or the other, from one sickness or the other, I decree and declare from you on this man today, oh, no shimmy, there is short we not have a party in life. Amen. Set your mindset right. At times, the battle God will tell you he has conquered. Oh, you you this that doesn't mean that the battle has not been conquered. It is just the and a shadow does not have bone. A shadow does not have strength. So why are you now scared of it? Let me move towards it. And tell God. I have not been your confidence. I have that confidence. I have the conviction. That my God has been conquered. And once. The reason why Satan will bring it to your is heart is to make you doubtful. Only and you doubt, to doubt, you you doubt, doubt, you doubt, doubt, you doubt, person you doubt, doubt, 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 you doubt, Hallelujah. Amen. Now, fast, fast. How can how to recognize and benefit and be a beneficiary of opportunity for supernatural expansion? How to recognize and be a beneficiary of opportunity for supernatural expansion? Hallelujah. Amen. Number one. Work in spirit. To discern the opportunity for supernatural expansion. Work in spirit. You know, I said supernatural expansion. That is something that is divine. And you have to work in the spirit. You have to work in spirit. You have to be able to get it. When you work in spirit. You know, uh, last week we talked about that our opportunities come. Lost at the two ways, I told you how they can be able to get it. One that is declared, one that is declared, one that is declared, one that is declared, one that is Competition that is See, I want you to understand. Not, not all that comes in form of opportunity is opportunity. Some, they are satanic provision to break you into bondage. So not in spirit. When you are not in spirit, do you will not be able to discern which one is which one. You will not be able to know whether this one is an opportunity or not. As I have said, then, that, that, that the man came around and was uh, telling 
that are Luko, and I was having the intention of marrying her. I to the driver of the man, not was the driver. So you go you go driver any. At times, some things will come in such a way. Before you realize it, you fall into it. Before you know that it is not opportunity. So that is the reason why you have to work in spirit. This one is opportunity. This is not opportunity. And when you know in such a way, you will be able to the one that is opportunity. You grab it with it. And the one that is not. When Daniel in the book of uh, Daniel chapter six, when he was cast into the lion's den, hey, something happened there. Hey, the, for lion, uh, for the lions, when he was cast into, do you know that it was the spirit of God that instructed the lions? Not to eat it. I think they ate Daniel. Can you watch Daniel? It was who would have led so to. A great starvation. But because the spirit is not there, they were in spirit. Fast. 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 So Fast. 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 First, for within so so scientists, for you to eat in surplus. And in that point, hey, their uh, their prey came in. A prey was thrown. That is how some some people have like found themselves. Some things as opportunities. Once you know one, copy and find it. Once you got, you thought it was an opportunity. You don't know that there are some greater ones that you have missed. You know this one, you have missed. You know this one, you have missed. He said, and they waited. One needs to rule. They saw Daniel. One read Daniel. If not that uh, we were asked to fast. Hey. Hey. Look at how we would have. Uh, we would have eaten this man. But they. They persevere till they break. When it was in the morning, the king instructed, Break him out. They brought him out alive. The enemies that conspired against him, they are going to cast their side. To know whether the lions were uh, uh, there or not. Hey. And when they got there, by the time Daniel was leaving the dead, I was telling the lion, you can break your fast. 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 Some some people 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 people. People. And at that point, hey, the enemies were cast into I want the bed. Uh, immediately, we want the enemies and uh, uh, the lions devoured them. Want, I want you to be the one to go. The priest cast it into me, letting your life. Oh, why? You must say you shall see no more. You shall see no more. I say you shall see no more. You shall see no more. Every enemy that is saying that the condition you are now, that unpalatable condition you are, they are satisfied with it. If you want to go, you are the one of God. The power in the name of Jesus Christ. The power that destroy the enemies of Daniel. 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 Upon your enemies, all the power shall destroy them. Amen. 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 As you are stepping out of this place, oh, I decree and declare, hey, that's powerful hands. 
the powerful hand located Joseph from the prison and made him to, to mount the throne in the palace. I swear, descending from this mountain, I decree and declare that right hand will locate you with your seven powerful hands. I swear, descending from this mountain, I decree and declare whatever that has been blocking you before. Oh, God, I should be greatness from my feet. I should be success from my feet. I should be prosperity. As you are descending from this mountain, I command all such a thing. Oh, you are fire descend on it. Oh, you know, Lord, we shall call it. Tell you, Amen, 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 Amen.